So guys, for the first step, you wanna get into this screen. Now to get here, you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As soon as it turns on, you wanna turn it off again and then turn it back on again. You want to repeat this three times. So you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As soon as it turns on, you wanna turn it off again and then turn it back on again. You want to repeat this three times and then on the fourth time when your computer turns on again, it will then take you into this screen. It's gonna be saying that your PC did not start correctly. You wanna click on advanced options. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then command prompt. And now this will come up. And now once you're on this, you wanna type in bootrec space forward slash fix MBR, click on enter. And now you wanna type in bootsect space forward slash nt60 space sys, click on enter again. And now you wanna type in bootrec space forward slash fix boot, click on enter again. Now you wanna type in bootrec space forward slash scan os, click on enter again. Wait for this to load. And now you wanna type in bootrec space forward slash rebuild bcd, click on enter again. And now we're gonna type in SFC space forward slash scan now, and then click on enter. And you now want to run this scan. Wait for this to load. I'm gonna skip the video to when the scan will be fully completed. And now for the last command, we're gonna type in chkdsk space. And now you wanna type in your Windows drive letter. For me, it's gonna be C colon. If it's not C colon for you, then just change the letter. But for most of you guys, it's also going to be C colon. Space, full slash F, space, full slash R. And then click on enter. And you now want to run this final scan. Wait for this to load. And now once that's been done, we can now close out of this. Now you want to continue to Windows and this should not fix your problem.